Hey guys, Nero2010 here. Finally got something in the mail. Uh, Going to be setting up my iFinity. Got it in from Dell, which is my mini, or sorry, display port to DVI adapter. Thanks to uh, watching uh, eFaco5 uh, on YouTube. Um, I didn't make a mistake by going and getting a passive adapter, but an active one. So, as you may have seen on other videos, there's the display port. There is the USB. And that's where the DVI goes. So, as you can see, right now I only have one, two monitors going, and number three. Which, they're not all the same. They're all LG. The center one's the newest. This was my older monitor. And this one I bought at a decent price for I think like 150 But it's still an older generation than the center one. So it would be pretty neat to see uh, all three going at once. Um, I'm going to do some benchmarks with uh, Battlefield Bad Company 2. Um, on just a single monitor. Um, what I can do is uh, use fraps and I'm going to play a little section and we'll see what my benchmark is. Just a, a small section that I can't beat in the game right now. Maybe once I got the affinity it'll be a little bit easier to beat. But uh, yeah, let's check out this little section just on one monitor and see what my frame rate is with my ATI Radeon 5850. Alright, so I'm just going to try this on one monitor for Battlefield Bad Company 2 before I set up my Affinity and see what the frame rate difference is. Uh, I'm running it at resolution 1680 by 1050. My overall quality is set to high. Uh, I've never tried advanced. Uh, advanced actually gives you what you actually want to have everything running at. So I think high is probably everything that I have under advanced as it looks like custom settings and the aliasing for uh, intratosopic filter times 4 uh, v-sync off HBAO not sure what it is it's on everything else is set to high that's the highest setting you could have so I'm going to go to set it back to high and I'm just going to resume my game play it up to a point where I get to a plateau in this stage which I normally die at anyways, and then I'm going to try with iFinity and record all my benchmarks with fraps, see what my minimum, maximum, and average frame rate is. So let's, let's have a go. And you'll get a little brief look at how Battlefield Back Company 2 looks too. So I play this several, this section several times and can't beat it, so I know where all the guys are. Turn on fraps. I forgot to turn it on. launcher and then I'll try the same with Ifinity. Let's exit. Turn off props. Exit the game. Exit the game. Let's go into props. View. There's my benchmarks. Let's just look at the summary. So minimum 49 frames per second. Uh, maximum 89 frames per second, average uh, 61 frames per second, which is very playable. And that's just on one monitor using a 5850 uh, Radeon, ATI, uh, ATI Radeon 5850. 
So what I'm going to do now is set up my, my affinity and see what my frame rate is for the high setting uh, for Battlefield Bad Company 2. Okay, so we've got the high affinity going now on one of the Radeon 5850s. Now we're going to do a comparison and uh, see how the frame rate actually does compared to just one monitor. So it's not the same scene as before because I actually beat it. So this is going to be a little bit different section of the game. So let's see what kind of frame rate I got. I'm just going to enable uh, props right now. And just play a little section and we'll see what we got. zoom in on the main monitor so we can check out the results so I'm going to pause the camera for now. Alright so there are the results um, up top here if you can see my mouse cursor moving up there is uh, the original single card going so that was 49 minimum 89 max average 61 frames per second and then with running iFinity you have 18 frames per per second minimum max 33 average 24.115 so that means I'm gonna have to uh, if I want to play affinity I gotta put this into crossfire um, definitely something I'm considering doing right now if I want to play on my affinity kinda makes you think that I should have got the 5970 at this point if you're gonna run affinity so uh, still ran pretty smooth. Can't say I was disappointed with the one card running, but uh, I think I'm definitely going to be dropping in a second card. So if you guys are interested in uh, watching more, uh, make sure uh, you subscribe, comment, and uh, check out the other videos. See you guys later.